What's up guys, it's Andy with Inland Boat Company. Today, I wanna to share with you a unique low hour Moomba that we just took on trade. It's a 2020 Moomba Helix, and it was used at Lake Gaston for its entire life. It comes with the boat, the cover, and the trailer. Let's run through some important specs and maintenance features so that you know you're buying the right boat. The boat dry weight is 4,000 pounds with the trailer and gear planned for 5,500 pounds towing. It comes as equipped with 2,400 pounds of factory and plug and play ballast. It's got the Raptor 400 6.2 liter engine with only 153 hours on it. We'll probably have 155 hours after we do a proper lake test. Some recent services that we did on this Moomba include a certified systems check of all electrical, safety, mechanical, and stereo products. We did a compression test on all eight cylinders of the engine. We did a good cut, polish, and wax. We did an oil change with a new impeller, and we replaced a ballast pump that you'll see on that certified systems check. Now let's walk around it. Starting on the exterior, we've got a nice white hull. It's got black accent and then black metallic decals around the side. Chrome Moomba logos, tandem axle trailer. These are the Dexter Vault bearings. Towards the back of the boat, you have a nice soft grip pad across the top. This is a gator step pad. Up underneath, you got your cavitation plates and your surf system on the sides. Up underneath the boat is a four blade prop and rudder. Let's hop inside. On the interior, we've got a really nice textured white, light gray and black accent interior. You have a nice step through transom so you can step from the back of the boat to the center and even a step plate here inside. If we look underneath the hood, we've got plug and play ballast bags on both sides. And of course your six two liter Raptor 400. This is a closed cooling system and it's only got right now 153 hours. You got swivel board racks, two eight inch tower speakers and a foldable bimini with surf and rope storage. On the dash, we've got all of our ballast control, our zero off cruise control, things like the blower, lights, and accessories. You can adjust your wake plate in the center plate. I don't know if you can hear that in the video easily with this cavitation adjustment on the side. Let's take a look at all the storage we've got. We've got a dual battery system with a plug-in charger for your dock. We've got a safety kit with dock lines and fire extinguisher. Again, good deep storage down the side. And then in the bow of the boat, we have a removable cushion. So it's easy to walk up into the front or pan out and spread out like so. I'm a really tall five foot seven, but I've got plenty of space no matter what direction I'm facing. And there's your walk up if you do choose to remove this cushion. Now let's take this boat to the water out on Falls Lake here in Raleigh, North Carolina and see what you'll do.